Hey, Chef Pinkie Pie, the great and powerful Trixie wants to help with cooking. Well, you can make one cup cupcake, so you can have it for your yourself, or a muffin if you want to. Yep, muffins it is. That'll be the snack today. Okay, let's look at the recipes. We can do blueberry blueberry muffins. Uh, or strawberry muffins? I don't know! What do you think, Trixie? How about we do a cross between blueberry muffins and an orange mu- and orange muffins? Oh my gosh! I've made that, that kind of mu muffin in, in years! You, know, you go make your, your muff muffin. Blueberries and, and oranges. I will. I'm going to go. As in, I'll go to the swamp and get, and get one of those weird flower thingies. And and then put it in there. So here I go. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting, and they had to hire a new one. <laughs> I've got it. Well, now it's time to make it into a cupcake. Cupcake! <sighs> I'm done. How you doing, Chef Pinky? Great! You can have the cupcake you made! Hey, go right on to your table! Your lunch table! So, well, I serve the rest of the muffins! Yes! All those times... All the second time... All the time she said cup... She and I said cupcakes, we actually meant muffins. Sorry. Everyone! Muffins are ready! Say sorry by giving you a muffin. I actually got it in the swamp, but I still got you a muffin. Wow, so nice of you. So, how do you feel? I <coughs> actually feel kind of strange. Trixie, why did you put in this? Later. We came as soon as we heard. Thank you, Twilight. We need all the help we can get. Oh no, what happened? It was a mishap with some of the baked goods. No. Not a baked good, a baked bad. I'm sorry. We're gonna need to send you home early. You look very sick. I mean, Nurse Redheart is still trying to figure out what's what's wrong. Do you think it's serious, Doctor? Well, that wasn't a good sign. I can't believe a flower did this. I take back thinking it was pretty. <coughs> We're looking for any color other than red. Phew. <gasps> oh. I'm afraid you have a very rare disease called Swampy. Well, as Cameron would say, is it contagious? I don't think she'll be in school tomorrow. Sorry, you guys. Okay. 
I have an idea, but I'm going to need, need to use my my foreseeing powers for them, for it to work. Because she means more to me than anything. One of my friends. Except for Ella. There, tomorrow there's gonna be a meeting af after history class. Tomorrow? Wow, they must be doing something to solve this. Tomorrow? This day just doesn't feel right without Ella, which is something I never thought I'd say, considering she's a little. Annoying. But unfortunately, that's just the way life is. Don't worry, Jasmine. Well, I have an eye. Af after class, it'll give us all the clue the clues, because I know which pillar we're, we're learning about today in history class. Good morning, class. So, as you know, Ella is absent today, so... So she'll have to catch up on, on this, this lesson and on the pillar of healing later on. I'm gonna do a read, read aloud of, of her most. of Mage Me Meadow Brooks mo most awesome accomplishment. And, and a read aloud uh, out of, of the entry in her diary. And yes, she didn't mind. So, don't worry. Now, let's start. Now, let's start. Today, my mom made me eat peas. Oh, darn. <laughs> Whoopsies. Wrong hung entry. Sorry, class, but I found it now. Today, I tried again to brew an unsniffle elixir. And I finally got it right. I think it's time you had this. My very own healer's mask! You think I'm ready, Mother? Mm-hmm. What calls this? Mother calls it swamp fever. We've been trying to find a cure, but it hasn't been easy. Wildfire. <laughs> I fear if we don't find a cure soon, Everpony will be in grave danger. <coughs> With Mother sick, I didn't think I'd ever find a cure. But staring at those cursed flowers today, I saw something. And if they were immune to swamp fever, their honey could be the cure. I know what I learned. We found a way to 
need to cure our friend. At school. Now's our chance to do this, guys. We're gonna get our friend, friend back, back from, from the despair of this disease that doesn't exist exist in a, in the human world. Yeah, most mostly because. I sort of miss her singing because I need something to be annoyed by. Yeah, I do kind of miss her. Ah, I'm only helping because ever since we he entered this upside down world, things went crazy. For us at least. Yeah, I actually kind of, of like her singing too. While you guys are talking hang about how you miss Ella's singing, I'm go I'm going to get to get that honey all by myself. Because has Sunset Shimmer, you don't know this about me, because but I'm pretty good with animals. So let me just go up there and get that honey. <laughs> Flash bees, I was hoping I could get some of your honey. Oh, I see. You don't let others have any. Well, I'm sorry, but I really need it. Oh, you didn't want it to have to come to this, but I just have to use the sting. Give up hope, hope, Dawn. That's what Ella would do. Not give up hope. Don't worry. I think I know what Mage Meadowbrook did. She, she that ma Healy mask thingy. Bee faced Ray to get the honey. Is a great idea. I feel a bit hurt from those bees, but I think I'll still be able to take them. Now give me that mask. Time to do this. <laughs> Someone found, found, found the cure to the to that one disease. <laughs> cool, huh? <laughs> 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 